Hey guys, this video is just going to be a quick rundown on me making these little torch thingies, placing them in the Forsaken Fortress in Unreal Engine. I wanted to do something that wasn't what you see on this screen right now. I didn't want to go through and place individual lights and individual particle effects because as you can see, it gets a little out of hand. You have to select everything in the outliner and you know, make sure things are organized in some kind of folder to keep track of things. And of course, name them, which I don't. So anyways, the uh, process can be a little tedious. And when it comes down to fine tuning and adjusting color or brightness of the lights or you know the particular effects, uh, it gets a little annoying. So I decided to try to make a little tool that will aid with this. This is my first attempt. I actually did not like this at all because I had to go select the individual empties that I created and um, you know it's just an empty seam component and there's nothing to really click on so when it came down to trying to duplicate as you see here I had to make sure I had the thing selected or I had to go through the outliner to find that particular part so this is my second attempt and you can see that this is a little bit more easier to deal with and streamlined this translucent blue mesh is just a visual aid for me to line up and make sure the rotations are right and then the blueprint itself goes in and replaces all the blue meshes with an instance mesh so I don't really have to worry about doing all that by hand. I could also just create a uh, instance mesh component and just you know duplicate that way but then I'd have to do some kind of code that spawns the Niagara system and the light at the same time. I didn't want to do that. So here's the uh, finished product. I think it was pretty cool. You can see it looks pretty nice. I really dig this effect, the particle system I got. I, I did not make it, I found it on Epic Games, don't worry about it. Now it's gonna be much easier to go through and add torches and probably go back and replace the torches that I did on the outside, uh, seeing as they are part of the main Forsaken Fortress model and not a separate kind of mesh. And the Forsaken Fortress model, as you can see from this little clip, uh, it's not done. I'm trying to make it completely seamless and in doing so I have to make some huge cuts and move a lot of geometry around to say the least. I don't even have working water here but you can see you can go straight into the next room no problem no loading screen no nothing but the exterior mesh did not line up with the interior of it at all and um, that's about it. Let me know what you guys think of this if you like the particle system at all or anything and uh, Thanks for watching.